weirdness. Um, the gods' prisoners are uh, the, those heads that are back there that are repurposed from last year's pageant. What is he? This is a big giant puppet that we used also last year that I walked up Kite Hill in, and it's going to look like one of those humans, and it's going to be better proportioned, hopefully. And this is a hand. Oh my god. Right, so Very cool. Very cool. Hands. The other hand's over there. And I'm teaching workshops, so you can learn how to do this in case you want to they make can. something that's waterproof. And then there's going to be some gods. And the gods, uh, we're going to try and get at least four from different pantheons. Um, I want to do Ganesh. I want to do Quetzalcoatl. I want to do Anubis. Uh, I, want to just, I want to do all the interesting looking gods. And basically what the humans do is they, uh, they're their worshippers. So they like throw themselves down in front of the gods and, and worship, or they fight with each other. So this one's, got, this one's worshipper will fight with this one's worshipper. And then there'll be at least one or two of the humans that will be making new gods out of things they find in the crowd. Like, yeah, they'll pull, a, they'll, pull a, a shoe, they'll pull a shoe off of somebody and they'll put it in the middle of the street and everybody will work, the humans will worship the shoe and they'll call it a name. And, and basically the gods just sort of, all they do is just keep this big human on the path. He, he sort of wanders all over the place, and the gods sort of keep him generally on the path. But the humans, you know, who worship them, they, they get in the way. Um, One so shaft to all right. those in secret, click, 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 Side, right? Okay, go on the flat side. I gotta go, I gotta go. 